In our morning rounds, calculating your heart's real age, a new CDC report reveals that 70% of Americans live with hearts that are getting older faster than they are. So that raises the risk of a heart attack or a stroke. Our Dr. Tara Narul is a cardiologist at Lenox Hill Hospital in New York and joins us at the table. Let's talk about the concept of heart age. What is it and how does it work? Right, so basically heart age is the sense that your heart and your blood vessels may be aging faster than you are. So whether you're 30, 40, or 50, your heart may actually be much older. And this concept was really developed to help people have a simple way to understand their risk of heart attack and stroke, and hopefully to motivate them to make lifestyle changes to reduce that risk. So typically, if you come to the cardiologist, we sit down and we explain to you your risk, but we do it in a way that may not be so easy to understand. Mm -hmm. We actually tell you your risk in terms of heart attack or stroke over 10 years. So I might say to you, Gail, you have a 5% risk of having a heart attack or stroke in 10 years or a 20% risk. That's very ambiguous and a mm -hmm. lot of people can't wrap their head around that. And it's not very personal, but everybody understands age. Yeah. So you can actually get a real number on this because they have a calculator. How does exactly. it work? Exactly. So the calculator works by putting in your age, your gender, your systolic blood pressure, whether you're treating for high blood pressure, whether you smoke or are diabetic, and either your body mass index or your total cholesterol and HDL, and it spits out a number for you. So as an example, yeah. if we had, for instance, a 45-year-old woman who was overweight but was not diabetic and not hypertensive, but she smoked, her heart age would be about 60, 61 years old. Mm -hmm. um, if you took away the fact that she smoked and made her a non-smoker, her heart wow. age would drop to 49. Mm -hmm. So you can see very wow. clearly that significant difference you can make by changing those risk is, factors. Is this a gimmick or do you think it's a good predictor? That's a great question and that's really the important question. You know, it's nice to have a simple tool, but if it doesn't work, it's useless. Mm -hmm. uh, so researchers in 2000 2014 looked at that question. They studied 3,000 individuals and divided them into three groups. One group got traditional counseling. The second group got the risk score that I told you about with the percentage. And the third got the heart age. The heart age group actually, at the end of one year, dropped their heart age yeah. by about one and a half years, as opposed to the other groups who either minimally dropped it or actually increased their heart age. And the heart age group was four times more likely to quit smoking than the group that got the yeah. traditional percent risk score. So if yeah. you're old at heart, you actually can <laughs> get younger. Yes, fairy tales can come true if you're your young body. at heart, Anthony. <laughs> yeah. You can, and, and that's really the point of this, is to find a way to motivate people and say, look, control your blood pressure, stop smoking, get your weight in check, control your cholesterol, control your blood sugar. These are all preventable things. 200,000 deaths a year, that the CDC has estimated we can prevent. Yeah, I took the test and, you know, I'm 60 and it said I was 59. My heart was 59. I was very disappointed because I was hoping it would be 40 something. <laughs> <laughs> but it, it would go with the guy. It's good that it's younger. You should be happy yeah, with no. that. Yeah. That it One also year. said that I'm overweight and I should do something about that is what the test said, which would go with the guy from Twitter who said, Gail, I look at you, you look like a big hot air balloon. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I, I, I feel well, like naming him, but I won't. But Nora, yours was younger. That don't don't give in to that haterade out there. On you the tell him how old your heart is. Oh, all right. I was just about to type him back and I stopped. But Nora, <laughs> yeah. yours was younger. Hers was younger than mine. 33. Yeah. That's good. 33. Mine was 34. See, I wanted that. Look at all these young people Got at the some table. work to do. Got some work to do. Thank you, doctor. Thank I think this you. is a good test. Thank I like you. it. Even if I didn't like the answer. If, and you, if you too want to calculate your heart age to see how you're doing, we've made it easy for you. Go to CBSThisMorning.com.